in-frame overhaul versus out-frame overhaul. There is two different types of repairs you can do on these heavy-duty trucks. In-frame means then the engine stays on the truck, like this one. This engine is being repaired and it is in the truck. It is an in-frame overhaul. Out-frame is when you have the engine outside the frame, like these engines I have here. So the engine is outside, it's out of the frame, and it's going to be repaired. So what is the difference between those? Both of the jobs are going to be the same, which is repairing an engine. But in frames repair, then this engine is going to be repaired, like we're gonna replace cylinder liners, we're gonna replace pistons, we're gonna replace connected and main bearings, we're gonna replace head gasket, the head, if it's necessary, and also other gaskets that are around the engine. Out frame, in the other hand, which is this one, the out frame refers that we are going to take apart the whole engine. The whole engine has to be disassembled. So, which means the oil cooler has to be removed, fuel filters have to be removed, fuel pump got to be removed, crankshaft got to be removed, all the accessories, compressor, water pumps, gotta be removed, turbo chargers, exhaust manifolds, all that gotta be removed to do an old frame overhaul. So, old frame overhaul is more expensive than in frame overhaul. The in frame overhaul can be around $16,000 in today's money, 2023. Old frame overhaul can cost around twenty dollars to $30,000 to do the whole job. The reason why is because we have more components to repair. In this case, for example, that in-frame overhaul, we still have the oil cooler on it, we still have the fuel filters on it, we still have the fuel pump on it, the fan clutch, water pumps, AC compressor, turbocharger was removed because of the head, the transmission is, it is on it, the rear housing and everything is in it. So that's the reason why it's cheaper. In this case, an out frame, well, you can see it's completely out of the frame, which means that we have to remove transmission, we have to remove all the components that are behind the engine and in front of the engine to remove the engine. And whatever holds the engine, supports, hoses, electrical cables, and other components that are part of the vehicle. So that's the reason why out frame overhauls are more expensive than in frame overhauls. In this video, I just wanted to talk about this so that way when you refer about doing an in frame, you're referring to do this job right here, the one I'm doing right here. But if you refer, then you are going to do an overhaul in frame and you're gonna replace the crankshaft. You are not doing an in-frame, you are doing an out-frame overhaul. Of course, right, doing an out-frame overhaul, it takes more labor, it takes more dedication to it because it is not just removing the engine. There is many components that you have to remove and put back the same way they were. And also, when you remove an engine completely, there is other components that probably you can replace because it's pretty easy to accent them with the engine completely removed. So that's the reason why an out-frame overhaul is gonna be more expensive. In the other hand, an in-frame, well, just refer to doing whatever torque, whatever we can do to the engine, and whatever component is broken, well, that's a separate job. We are going to do that separately. So it is not going to be part of the job. So it, it, that's the reason why it's cheaper to do this, because we can do just the engine and don't care about if the clutch is broken, we don't touch it. If the transmission is broken, we don't touch it. But in this case, an out frame, the clutch is broken. Hey, we already have the clutch out. Let's put a new clutch. Transmission is broken. Hey, the transmission is out. Let's put a new transmission. So the labor is pretty, pretty much the same. You are not going to charge more to do a, a transmission or a clutch replacement in an out frame overhaul because the transmission is already out. But in this case, because the transmission has to be removed, well, yes, you have to do all the, all the labor to remove the transmission and then put it back because the engine has to stay in the truck. But 
it's just a little talk I wanted to do about it because uh, I I see a lot of people having problems talking about doing a an, a repair, an engine repair, and some of them refer a, as an in frame as doing the whole engine. So if if you get to this point, if you have to do a repair to your truck and you are going to uh, um, to do the whole job, but it's not going to be, the engine has not, um, it's not necessary for the engine to come off the vehicle, then you are just, you just need to do an in-frame. Just remember that. Well, this is all I'm going to be talking on this video. Just a little talk about it. And um, that is pretty simple. And uh, questions about it, you can comment below. Uh, you can see me on Instagram and see other things that I'm doing there. Anything that you wanna add to this video in the comment section below is more than welcome as well. So like this video, share it, subscribe, and thank you for watching.